Welcome to HSM Express. Let's get your eight pound weights. Let's put them in your hands. Take your feet out to wide second. Bring your shoulders up, drop them down. You're ready to get working. Let's take those ribs, zip them up. Bellies are in, palms to the ceiling. Let's go, we're taking it down. Up. So this is your express class. This is a 35-minute class where you can get a whole body done in 35 minutes. So keep that core on and strong. You're going to follow Rachel Ferrer today, one of our newer instructors. She's good. She's going to show you your modifications, the options if you're more of a beginner. More advanced, you'll watch our director of training, Lee Canelli. She's got you. Let's bring it on and strong. Let's go for five. Here we go. Four. Dropping it low. Three. Here it goes. Two, on one, stick it low. We're going with a high heel, low heel. So you're feeling this inner thigh stretch while you work into these biceps. So drop those hips low. Feel that strength through the entire body, starting from the core, going right into those biceps. You've got six more. Nice work, Lee. So we've got a little crowd in here. They're walking strong at home. Keep your water nearby. Keep a towel nearby. We're going to get that heart rate up. You've got your lighters, right? Let's go for two. On one, heels come down. Give me a twist and a twist. Pregnancy, you're following me. Low back, you're following me on that beat. Let's go. It's side, side, side. There it is. I hope you got your Spotify list up because you want that, those, <laughs> that tunes pumping. You're getting strong. Here we go. Let's go. Eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, on one, take it even lower. Bring one heel high, other heel high, hold. Your move is down itch, up an itch. If you feel any pain in your hips, any pain anywhere in your joints, your heels on the floor, you take that break. You'll follow Rachel. She'll stay a little higher. Yeah, so she'll take a break. She'll drop to lighter weights or even no weights at time. You've got options here. Two more. On one, take it right here, give me a little high heel, low heel, high heel, low heel. So keeping those shoulders back, keeping the chin lifted. We are working straight up into that core. Let's go for three. You got this. For two, keep those heels high, pulse it down for five. Follow Rachel, heels on the floor. For four, three, two, heels come down, arms are here. Turn your toes forward. Hinge your body. Staying high with Rachel, staying low with Lee. Give me that little reach down, reach, squeeze. So you want to feel that flat back here. So no more curving. You're keeping that core on and strong. You're feeling those shoulders too. You're feeling those inner thighs stretch. Let's bring it on three more times. Let's go for three, two. Now hold it out here. Give me a little high heel, low heel. Yeah. How low are you going to go? How strong are you going to be? How much do you want to get this work done? We got 35 minutes. We are in it to win it. Here we go. Let's go. Five. You got it, Caroline. For four, three. We're getting low. Two. Hold strong. Ten pulses here. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight. Look at you. Let's get it strong. Let's go in strong. Let's go for it. Five, four, three, two, on one. Drop it low. We're going down, up back here we go so keeping that head level shoulders over hips ears over shoulders this is strong work this is coming out of the core core belly flat back strong that's key you got five let's go four let's go for three for two hold nice and low on one let's give me a little punch 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 you got five more five four Three, two, hold low. Ready? Then that little high and low. High and low. Let's go for two. On one, keep your heels right here. We're going down itch, up an itch, down itch, up. There it is. Four more. So notice Rachel dropped to her lighter weight. She picked up some fives. You push it to your edge. You find that edge every time. For two, hold it nice and low. Let's go. High heel. Low heel, high. Oh yeah, life is good. Here we go. Those are your biceps. You feel them? Those are your inner thighs. That is your core. Show you is strong. Let's go for three. Three, two. Hold nice and low. Pulse it in for five, four, three, two. On one, bring those arms forward. Toes forward. Hinge your body. Give me a little reach, squeeze. Yes. 
Again, staying right here. She's still keeping those shoulders back. Finally, she's crazy low. Looking at this room, these girls have got it on. Find your edge at home. That is that place where you go. You don't think you can do more? You got one more. You got it. Hold it right here. Give me that little high heel, low heel, high, low. Now, that's the core work. So keep that belly deep. You got five more for four, three. Here we go. Two. Hold the heel up and pulse it down. Ten. Nine. Can you drop those hips low? You feel that stretch? You feel that strength? You've got five, four, three, two. Stand it all the way up. Drop low. Give me a high heel, low heel. Three more. For two. Now hold right here. Your move is high heel, halfway down, out. Give me a little high heel. So we're not going to that full extension right here. You're keeping the heat in the biceps. Rotator cuff working. It's all good. Inner thighs stretching, so drop those hips low. For two. And out. Last one. Breathe. Drop it low. Now hold. Bring those arms forward. Heels so high. 20 curls. Up and down. That's enough, Lee? Yeah, I think we could do more. But we're not. So get it strong. Get it low. We've got this. 14 more. So drop those hips. Shoulders are open. Look at this crowd. You've got it, Michelle. Let's go. Up and down. Final 10 starts now. So drop those hips. Open that chest. Take that imaginary jacket. Zip it up tight. That is your core. That is your strength. Final five. Final four. We got a hole coming in three. In two. Hold low. Pulse first. Let's go for five, four, three, two. Drop low. Extend those arms for ten, nine, eight, seven, six. You've got this. Five. Drop low for four. Three, two, one. Hands are on your floor. Grab your gliders. I want your hands on your floor. You're going to watch Rachel. Modification. She will use no gliders today. She will find that plank. Yeah, Rachel, I want you on your knees, though. Yeah, she, here she goes. Now, here's what you're doing. You're holding with your feet on that glider. We're causing a little bit more heat on that core. You want to bring those inner thighs together because we're going to start to run it out. You ready? Let's go. Drive it in. Let's go. It's in, 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 in. Feeling those knees just pressure into your chest. Feeling those hips nice and low with the shoulders. You've got this work. We're getting it done. 35-minute workout, total body. It's right now. Let's go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Stick it right here. Now take your hands wide. Now keep your hips in line with your shoulders. Here we go. Bear push-ups. We're bringing the knees in for two, out for two, pushing down, and then exhaling up. On that beat, let's bring it in, out, lower, and lift. You got eight more. There it is. Lower and lift. Yes, options on your knees. That's it. Find your edge. That's all you got to do. At some point, you might find these gliders. You can do them. But wherever you are, push it to that place where you don't think you can do another more. And do that one more. And you got it. How many got, Lee? Two more times. We're going to bring it in under the hips and lower. One more time. In. Out, lower hands go under your shoulders. You got one minute on that plank hold. My eyes are on this clock. I've got it right here. You've got 55 seconds left. We will stand it up for some deltoids, but right now your heart rate is already up. And that is the beauty of Hilliard Studio Method. We are doing a total body workout in 35 minutes. We generally do an hour, but if you've got 30 minutes, sometimes you've only got 15. Find it. We've got it for you. Hold strong. Eyes are on the clock. Bring your inner thighs together and squeeze them. You want to feel that? That. I know you got those gliders there. I know you can't touch them, but imagine them touching right here. Hold strong. You got less than 30 seconds on this clock. Life is good. We're bringing it down. 20 seconds. You ready? We're just going to stand it straight back up. Pick those eight pound weights up. Oh, life is good. Final bit. Final 15. This is it. Thank you for the. <laughs> these girls really appreciate those fans. I hope you got a fan at home. You got this. Final eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Just stand it up. Pick up your eight-pound weights. Here we go. All right, you ready? Here we go. What are we doing? Yeah, bring your shoulders up. Now take those toes forward. Drop to the right. We're going up, down. Keep up following Rachel. Her right foot will stay on the floor. Rest of us, bring it up. There it is. Bring it up. If that is too much for you, pregnancy, 
Low back pain, we are hearing you. You've got options. You're falling right here. Rest of you getting strong. We got four more for four, three. Here we go. Two. Lock and load that right here. Give me that little kick. Bend. So it is a controlled movement. It is find that balance. You got three more. There it is. For two. On one. Hold right here. Pulse it up. Four. Three. Two. Arms go wide. Take that leg behind your eight or head. Eight. There it is. Seven. Yes. Or maybe you come to standing and you just find those presses. Follow Rachel again. There it is, Lee. For three. For two, you got to hold. You know you got to hold. Give me eight seconds. Hold. Eight. Seven. We're going to stand it up in six, five, four, three, two, on one. Step it up. Take those knees, left knee bend. You ready? Same thing. You're going overhead. Start feet on the floor and then bring it up. Lower. Heart rate coming up. Taking those weights directly above your head. Falling right here. Fall right there. Yes, you've got this. Bring it strong and on. Here we got up. Four more. Let's go for four. Here we go. Three. You guys look good. Two. Lock and load right here. Give me that extension. Bend. Extension. It is controlled. It's coming right from that core. You got three more. We'll pulse it out. In two. On one. Pulse it up for four. Four. Three. Two. One, bend that knee in half. Arms are overhead, eight overhead. She's on it. It's down, up, lower, and lift. Six more, six. We've got this. We're going to stand it up after that hold. Here we go. Final three, final two. Hold right here, heel is high. Hold five, four. Do not lose your arms. And three, two, on one, feet are under your assistance. Eight overhead right there. We're icing that cake. Yeah, this is that cake you're baking today. You're bringing it strong and on. You're strengthening these shoulders. Final bit. Final three. Here we go. Two. Five seconds. Hold. Five, four, three, two. Hands are on the floor. Welcome to Hilliard Shooting Method. This is hard stuff. This is a challenging class. Listen to your body. Falling again. Rachel. She could be, she's going to be on her knees. You guys are holding. Those feet are on the gliders. Grab your water, suck it down, but don't stop. Hold with me. In five, four, three, two, let's drive it home. Let's bring it little in, 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 in. Driving those knees into your chest. Keeping those hips nice and level. Feeling that core work. That's good stuff, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Oh, I like what Caroline's doing over here. She's taking a modification. She's taking it nice and safe and smooth. Everybody's different. You got ten more. Ten. Nine, eight, here we go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take your hands wide. Angle those elbows back. We're going to pike, plank, push up. You got 10 on the beat. Here we go. It's pike, plank, push up. Looking good. We're piking it up. Plank, push up. Now make that smooth. There it is. You want to breathe in through your nose. When you exhale, you want to use it on your exertion. That helps that core strength. That helps maintain that perfect form. How we got? It's pike. Yeah. How we got? Final four. We got final bit coming here. Final three starts now. Let's go hips high nicely. You guys, both, we got two leads in here. It's going high, hip high and lower. One more time. This is it. Take it low for that push-up. Taking your hands under your shoulders. This is when you're starting to drip that sweat. You feel this? Belly's in, shoulders back, eyes on the clock. You're in it to win it because you've only got 5 oh, 50 seconds to go. Once again, option. Always option to come to your knee. The option is always to come into a modification because you want to keep it safe and you want to keep it strong. And as you do that, you will see the results. It is not about how many straight leg push-ups you can do. It's how many you can do in the perfect form. And at Hill, your Studio Method, we're going to keep you there. Don't you like it when I talk? Because you only got 30 seconds left. Life is good. Head is high. Bellies are in. Feel the strength of that back, the strength of that core, the flatness of that belly. Yeah, we're not looking at low back pain here because we're strengthening that low back. Hold strong. 15 seconds on the clock. You ready? Counting down. Let's count this final 10. How about starts right now? Let's count it for 10, 9, 8, 7. Here we go. 6, 
five, four, three, two, one. Stand it up. You're going to have your, eight, your three pound weights. I've got no weights at all. That's an option. So take your feet out wide. And they give me a little high, low, high, low. There it is. And Rachel is showing you the no option. Now, what is she doing? She's also making a fist. Every time you squeeze that fist, you engage these shoulders a little bit more, about 15% to be precise. You've got three, two, on one. Toes are four. Bring those arms here. Bend it low. Right hand over left. We're going up, down, up, lower. Nice and, and strong. There it is. Lower and lift. Let's go for five. You got it. For four, nice and nice and controlled. For two, hold right here. Shoot those arms out. Shoot that leg out. Give me bend. Press, press. Find like your lower leg. Find lean, high leg. Find your strength. You've got this. For four, three, two, on one. Give me a little down inch, up an inch in that standing leg. That bothers your knee at all. You hold still for four, for three. Hold strong on one, 10 lifts with those arms, 10 with the legs, eight, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Bend that knee in half, bring those elbows in. We are gonna fly like the wind. You ready? Pull the belly in. Give me a little squeeze, press back. Squeeze, press back. So Rachel's gonna show you both feet on the floor. That is an option. She is working through these posterior delts, these rhomboids. Shoulders are down her back. Core is strong and on. Leah, she's showing you that flying option. For three, for two, hold it nice and strong. 20 lifts right here. Yes, and maybe you need to come down both feet to the floor for a second, and then you take it back. Final 10, let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. We're coming out of this in 5, 4, Three, two, looks like this. Stay low. Take your waist to your chest. Bring that right knee into your chest. Open that chest and bring that leg out. We call this shoot the duck. <laughs> yeah, we do. We like this. So this is the opposite movement. You're working your core. You're working your abs. You're keeping that leg fondly right there. Give me that bend press. Tricep work all the way through that core and leg. Bend press. Bend press. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, follow Rachel Mod. Three, we're gonna follow Rachel right now. Everybody's feet are going to the floor, high heels. 20 lifts, up an inch, up an inch. Oh yeah, here we go. Little lobs, little lobs. So we got this now, we're going to the floor in 10, nine, eight, you ready? Seven, six, five, four, turn your music up. Three, two, on the floor, find your gliders. We got a 10 second hold, we are moving fast. We are almost there. We got one more set of those three pound weights. In five seconds, you're going into runs. You got it? Here we go. In four, three. Let's run that in. Let's go. Let's drive it in, 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 in. Fawn and Rachel, knees are on the floor. Carolina, I'm going to call you out because she's got perfect form. She's right here. She's doing the slow track. That is controlled. That is strong. Let's count it. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, on one, take your hands wide. We are gonna twist to the left and to the right and push up. Here we go, it's going left, back, push up to the right. Right, working those obliques with that chest work, with that full body work. It's a push up, oh yeah, it's a twist. Yeah, we don't wanna miss that waist, right? We wanna keep those obliques working. We wanna keep that waist cinched in and strong. In, out, lower, how we got? We got four more, yes. Lower and lift, final three. Here we go. One more in on each side. We're gonna bring it in, out, lower. Last one, in, out, lower. You got one minute, hands are under your shoulders, eyes are on the clock. Oh, here we go, this is it. This is that final bit, hold strong. We got one more plank hold after that next set of light weights. And then we are almost home. This is your 35 minute workout. You can get this done. This is results oriented, action oriented, heart rate is up, sculpting the body, toning the body. What else do we want? Not much, right? Hold strong, we got less than, we're at 30 seconds on that clock. 
Breathe in through your nose. When you exhale, feel that core connect. Maybe those inner thighs connect a little bit more. And maybe you feel a little stronger. And you push back into a straight leg, even if your knees are on the floor. Just reset. Give it a test. I know you got this. Hang with me at home. Final 10 starts here. Let's count it. 10, 9, 8. We're standing up in 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's stand it up. Wide second position. Arms are wide. Give me a little twist, 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 twist. Down nice and low. We're going 1, 2, 3, 4, up. Following Rachel, she'll stay higher. She's used to going low. She's going to stay higher. There she goes. And up. Two more. Down, two, three, four, up. You're looking good. Let's go. Down, two, three, four, stick. 20 literally little lifts. You want more? You follow Lee. She's going to bring those heels off the floor. What was more important here is you drop those hips low. You keep those arms out. You feel those deltoids? I know you do. I don't want to feel that neck pain. If so, you're finding that fist. Final five, four, three, two, on one, toes forward. We're going to take that left hand on top. We're bringing it up, lower, up. So we're back into that inner thigh, but this time we're moving a little bit faster, bringing it up, down, breathe as you go, controlled movement. If that is not for you, you follow Rachel. She is keeping it low, keeping it strong. You got two, unwind, hold right here. Give me bend, press, press, press. You've got five more, five, four, three, Two, we're going down inch, up an inch. If that standing leg is a problem, you are not doing that move. You're just keeping that whole stillness. For two, 10 little lifts right here. Let's go up. For 10, nine, eight, we're almost home, you guys. We've got this. Six, five, four, three, two. Bring that knee in. Elbow is here. Take it all the way back. Bring it into the body. Lift up. In, lift up. Once again, Rachel's your option. Once again, Lee's your option or anybody in this room. When you come out of it, when you fall out of it, don't worry about it. You have challenged your core like crazy. You've challenged your entire body. You've got this. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more. Squeeze. Press it back. Little 20 of these. Yeah. Get low in that standing leg. You are flying through the air. You have got this. Here we go. Final 10, 9, 8. You ready to shoot that duck? It's coming at you in Five, four, three, two, and one. Stay low. Just bring that knee in. This time, palms to the ceiling. Bend, press. Now, Lee's going to show you from the side again. So she's going to keep those chest, her chest open, but she's taking it low, and she's got a C curve. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Here we go. Six. Option right here. Five, four, three, two, and one. Both feet come to the floor. High heels. Twenty little lifts. Because you have got one more plank run to come. Let's go. It's up. You might as well get excited. We got this. Life is good. We've only got 10 minutes left in this class. Getting strong. Let's go. Up. Up. How many got? There it is. Final bit. Final five. Final four. Three. Two. Oh, yeah. You know where we're going? Back into the plank. Last plank run, you guys. Last one. <laughs> I got the rolling eyes. I got all kinds of stuff. I don't know what you're saying at home. But hang with us. Hold strong. We're holding strong for five seconds before we start to run those knees into your chest. You ready? Let's go. We're bringing it in, 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 in. Once again, option number one. I like this. I've got so many good modifications. That's Rachel on her knees, and I've got Caroline. Taking it strong and taking it in control. You got 10 more. Let's count it. Let's go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Take those hands wide. Some of my favorite push ups are coming right now. They're called X. Follow Lee. Looks like this. We're going down for two, up for two, low for two. The beauty of these is they stay slow, they stay strong, and they're hard. I hear you loud and clear. I, can, I think I can hear you. I certainly hear this crowd. You ready? We're taking it low for two. How many up? Five more? Five more of these. Nice and strong. Or maybe you just hold your stillness. I like what I see. Look around the room. Everybody's got a different body, a different thing they're doing today. It is about your edge. Two more. And this is your last hole coming up. Take it down to up. Don't even move. Just take your hands right under your shoulders. Eyes are on the clock. You ready? 60 seconds in your pocket. You've got this. 
Maybe you're on your knees with Rachel, but I'm going to challenge Rachel to curl her toes under and give me five seconds, maybe ten, with those straight legs. This is that last bit. If you feel any pain in your back, in your neck, shoulders, your knees are back. So, Rachel, go ahead and take your knees back to the floor, holding strong. Here we go. We are almost. Let me see what my clock says. We are at that 30-second mark. We will lay it over on that mat. We'll turn your mat. If you've got a mat at home or on your floor, we're going to work some glute work. So you'll have your blue balls in about 20 seconds. So get strong in every single time we walk in this door. Yeah, I'm going to help this crowd out. Breathe for me. We got this. Final 10 comes here. Let's count it. 10, 9, 8, 7. We got this. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I want you to come off of that. Put your body on your mat. You guys stay right where you are. Rachel and Lee, you turn toward each other and grab a ball. There you go. And I want you to lay down on your floor. Put the ball between your inner thighs. And I want you to take a moment to core connect. You got a ball between your inner thighs. Squeeze it. Core connect. Bring that rib cage closer. Put that low back down on the mat. Hands go to the mat. Take three pound weights on either side if you're more advanced. Following Rachel, no weights at all. Let's count it up. For two, we're going down. For two, let's roll it up. For two, stay there. Now dig your heels into the mat. More advanced, bring those three pound weights out and give me the little squeeze, curl under, squeeze, curl under. So following Rachel right here, she's keeping those hands on the floor. Following Lee right here, she's got some three pound weights. It's a little more advanced. Find your edge, find your place, squeeze. There it is. For two, on one, now hold it right here. Extend your right leg. That's what I said. Extend your right leg. Ready? All right. Let's go up and down to the floor. It's high. It's low. It's high. It's low. You've got this. High. Low. For five. We got this. For four. Oh, this is your hamstring work. You know you love this stuff. Inner thigh work, core work, chest work. For two. Now hold right here and give me little pulses up an inch. It's just a pelvic tilt. It's a little slight tilt. You can see what's going on right here. Yeah, give me little five, four. Now we're going to challenge you up for the final 20 before we change legs. And two and one. I want you to take those weights right down by your hips. Yeah, so give me 20. Give me a little up an inch, up an inch. Try to hover those arms. If that's too much, your hands are on your floor. Give me little tucks. Tuck. So it's that isolation of the hamstring muscle. It's the balance work of the body. This is why your body sculpts, but it's also why it's healthy because it's strong. Final two, final one. You got a five second hold. Bring those hips high for five, four, three, two, one. Hands to the floor. Take your hips to the floor. Both heels on the floor. Roll it up. Up for two. We're rolling it down for two. One more time. Roll it up for two. Hold that pelvic tilt. Bring those arms out wide. Advance and give me squeeze tuck. So you're using that ball to work your inner thighs to get a little more and a little deeper in that transverse abdominus. In the fire, deeper into the hamstring muscles, back of the leg, as well as those glutes. You got this. For four, three, two, opposite leg lifts. What's that? Your left one. Yes, ma'am. Give me tucks. Tucks. Now hold. We're going up and down. It's lift and lower. Keep those legs level. Yes, you're just bringing the hips up and down. You've got six more. How we doing? You got it, Stephanie. You're looking good. We've got this. For three. For two. Now hold strong right here and give me little tucks. Tucks. How we doing? You feeling good? Little tucks. 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 We have got this. You had it going in for five. Four, we're coming into that heat. And three, you're going, coming into it. I'm feeling it already. On one, take those hands down by your side. Bring those hips. Give me a little deeper tuck. 20 little tucks up. Up. So you feel that pressure of those little three-pound weights. They feel like they can't weigh 50. Hold strong. Give me little tucks. Tucks. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, five second hold right here for five, four, three, two, one. Great work. I want you to sit it all the way up. We're going to do a little ball abs. So if you've got your three pound weights, which I don't, and I'm not, I'm not going to worry about it. I want you to put the ball so you cannot move the ball if you sit up nice and strong, holding under your thighs. We're following Rachel. Her knees will stay bent. Following Lee, they'll go straight immediately. Tuck it under. Lean into that ball. Yeah, more advanced. Following Lee, we're going up for two back for two. So I'm doing it 
with no weight at all. And I can feel it because it's right here, down for two, going right deep into this transverse abdominus, deepest abdominal muscle in the body. Right on top of that comes those obliques, those waist muscles. And then finally, that six pack muscle called your rectus abdominis. So we're starting deep. We're starting strong. One more time. We're going up for two. Now hold right here, palms here, and give me a little bend, straighten. Bend, straighten. So yeah, you're getting a little tricep move, but what's more, you're getting a little deeper into those abdominals. Here we go. Strong work. You can do this when you're pregnant. Just do not use your waist. Hold strong, maybe following right here for three, for two. Now hold right here and pulse it up for five, four, three, two. Bring your arms into field goal. You're going back for two, up. Now, we're not arching the back like that, but we're keeping that tuck. So we're going back for two, up. One more time. Back, hold right here. Shoot your arms out. Give me bend press for eight, seven, six. You got it. Five, four, three. On one, bend them in half. Bring that right leg high. Let's twist to the right. Let's give me a twist. Center, twist. Working those obliques. Yes. Maybe holding onto your thighs. Yes, she's, like, she's so advanced, it's hard to make her hold back. I know it. Give me a twist. Good. You've got it for three, for two. Hold. Just hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Put both feet on the floor. Lift that opposite leg up. You ready? Let's go the other way. Give me a little twist. Center. Twist. Since I didn't count last time, you're going to tell me when we're at the end. Twist. How many you got? We only got six more. We have got this. We're going to challenge you in set five. You're going to challenge me. We've been doing this the whole time in three and two and one. Both feet are on the mat. Arms are in iron cross. Looks like that. 20 little lifts. Up an inch. Up an inch. There it is. You're like, wait, didn't we already do the shoulders? Guess what's happening? It's digging deep into those abdominal walls. Push back into that ball. Feel that strength. Final bit. Lifts. Oh. Oh, we only got five more. Let's go. Four, four, three. Ten seconds starts right now. Let's count it. Hold for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Put your weights down. Take that ball to the to the right here, to the mid back, not the low back. Right between your shoulder blades. Let's open up that abdominal wall. You've been working hard for 35 minutes. Keep those arms out wide. Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, remove the ball and bring your knees into your chest and give a little side to side. Feels so good, doesn't it? Yeah, and calm your music down. Take a moment. And then take that right leg cross and, cross and let's give that real right glute a little stretch. I think you need it, right? <laughs> and then let's do the opposite side. Just bring that left knee up on top. That's just your little reverse butterfly stretch. And then letting go, let's bring that right leg up. Walk your hands up to that calf. Circle the foot one way and the other way. Hold that hamstring stretch. Head and shoulders to the floor. Let's bring that left knee into your chest. Shoot that leg out. Lift that head. I want you to feel that stretch. Circle your foot one way and then the other. Bring it up a little bit more. And then bring your head and shoulders to the floor. Rock yourself up. We're going to finish where we started this class, and that's core alignment. Take your hands to your low belly. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Bring your shoulders up, down, and back. Close your eyes. Take the deepest breath of your day. As you exhale, feel that transverse abdominus nice and strong and controlled. Fingers to the rib cage. Take a deep breath. You guys did a great job. Zip up, zip up your ribs. Hold that core strong. Hands go to your knees, palms to the ceiling. Shoulder roll up, back, and down. Open your eyes. Great work. Happy day. You just said your express class at, Hill class at Hilliard Studio Method. We look forward to seeing you back here again. Great work.